Okay, now Samsung's reminder application is just fantastic. This is a natively built-in reminder application on all the Samsung Galaxy phones, which most of us use. Now for this application, Samsung has just pushed an all new update, which adds a very important and useful feature. Before we go ahead and take a look at this feature, if you're new on the channel, be sure you hit that subscribe button and become a part of Apex community to know your phone better. And if you find this video useful, you can go ahead and hit that like button as well. I would really appreciate that. All right, now let's look at the version number here it is 12.4.02.6000 in the changelog it says tap the image in the reminder to download or go to the website from which you saved the image as a screenshot. Now again, to know exactly what has changed, let's compare the latest version which I have already updated on this Galaxy S22 Ultra with the older version of Reminder application on this Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. Let's open Reminder application. I will tap on this plus button to add a new reminder. Now here in the section where you write the memo, we have got two small icons here at the bottom right. The extreme right one is an image icon. You can just tap on this to add any image from the gallery. Now before we add this image, let's go to Samsung Internet. We already have a web page open here. What I'm going to do is I will just take a screenshot on both these phones. Now let's go to gallery and open the same screenshot. As you can see, we have got an option on the screenshot right at the bottom, go to website, which means this particular screenshot, which we have taken from a website on the browser comes attached with the website link as well. We can just tap on this go to website here to directly visit the website on which we have taken this screenshot. Now let's go back to reminder app. I will tap on this image icon. I will just add the screenshot that we just took on the Samsung Galaxy browser. I'll tap on done. Now let's tap on save on both these phones. Now this reminder has been saved. Now let me open the same reminder again. As you can see, we have got the image right on top. Now let me tap and open this image on both the phones. As you can see on the latest version, we have got this all new feature. The same go to website option has been integrated into this reminder application now. Whereas in the previous version, you see we don't have go to website option, even though we have attached the same screenshot which was taken on a particular website on the browser. That is one addition we have got on the latest version. And we also have an option to download this particular image which we have attached on a reminder. As you can see, I can just tap on this to download this image. It just gets saved in the gallery. I don't see a purpose for this, but yeah, we do have this feature. Just in case if you want to download this image right from this reminder, you can download it here, even though you have attached it from the gallery. Uh, maybe if you have deleted that image from the gallery, you will be able to download it from this reminder. Or if you have shared a reminder with somebody else or on some other phone, you will be able to download it. Maybe for that reason, they have added this feature. On the previous version, we don't have go to website option. We do not have the download option as well. This is the feature which is now available on the latest version of Samsung Reminder application. It's really good to see the small minor tweaks which Samsung does to enhance the experience on all these stock applications. We really appreciate Samsung for doing this. Every now and then we get some new features added on the stock applications or the system applications, and that improves the usability of these apps on the device. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section below. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and do not forget to hit that like button as well. Thanks for watching. My name is Salyan signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.